Have you ever considered what it might be like to spend months or even years alone in the vast expanse of space? Imagine this. You're an astronaut surrounded by an infinite sea of stars, yet the closest star you can touch is millions of miles away. The only companions you have are your thoughts and the hum of the spaceship. In this realm of solitude, human contact becomes a rare commodity. You can't just pop over to a friend's house for a cup of coffee or hug your loved ones goodnight. You are confined to a tiny spacecraft, your world reduced to a few cubic meters. This isolation can lead to feelings of loneliness, even depression. It's not just about missing your favorite foods or the smell of fresh air. It's about missing the everyday interactions we often take for granted. Indeed, the vastness of space can seem overwhelming, and the isolation intense. Now imagine living in a space smaller than your average studio apartment, with the same view every day, the distant Earth. Picture it. Your world shrunk down to the confines of a spacecraft, your neighbors the same few people day in day out. Privacy? That's a luxury you had to leave behind on Earth. Living in such close quarters can be a daunting experience. The constant presence of others, the lack of personal space can take a toll on even the most resilient minds. It's not just about physical space but about mental and emotional space too. You're in a bubble and there's no stepping out for fresh air. Now shift your gaze to the window. There, in the vast expanse of space, floats our home, Earth. It's a sight that stirs deep emotions, a phenomenon astronauts call the overview effect. It's a profound cognitive shift, an awakening to the interconnectedness of all life and the fragility of our planet. But this awe-inspiring view isn't without its drawbacks. Seeing your home planet so small and so far away can intensify feelings of homesickness. It's a constant reminder of the world you've left behind, the people you miss, the sounds and smells of Earth that are absent in this sterile environment. So the breathtaking view of our blue planet might be a double-edged sword, offering both an enlightening perspective and a poignant reminder of what's left behind. How do astronauts deal with these psychological challenges, you might wonder? Well, there's been a wealth of research into this very question. Scientists have been exploring the psychological effects of long-duration space travel for years. And the findings have been fascinating. One of the key strategies astronauts use to maintain their mental health is maintaining a routine. This means waking up, eating meals, exercising, and going to bed at the same times every day. This sense of structure and predictability can help counteract the feelings of uncertainty and disorientation that can come with living in an environment that is so vastly different from what we are used to on Earth. Exercise is another important coping strategy. It not only helps maintain physical health, but it also boosts mood and helps reduce stress. Studies have shown that astronauts who exercise regularly during their missions report lower levels of anxiety and depression. Communication with loved ones back on Earth is also crucial. Regular video calls with family and friends can help alleviate feelings of isolation and loneliness. NASA and other space agencies also provide psychological support to astronauts, with professionals available for regular check-ins and therapy sessions. In terms of technological interventions, there's a lot of exciting research being done. One promising avenue is the use of virtual reality. This technology can simulate environments that are familiar and comforting to astronauts, helping to reduce feelings of confinement and isolation. Imagine being able to take a virtual walk through your favorite park or sit in your living room again, all while being millions of miles away in space. There's also ongoing research into the use of artificial intelligence and robotics to provide companionship and assistance to astronauts during long missions. This could be as simple as a robot that can hold a conversation or as complex as an AI system that can monitor an astronaut's mental health and provide interventions as needed. With ongoing research and innovative solutions, humans continue to adapt, making the dream of long duration space travel more attainable. So, space travel isn't just about technological advances, is it? It's also a journey into the human mind Facing the psychological trials of isolation, confinement, and the vast view of Earth from the cosmos, astronauts must brave these challenges, armed with research-backed coping strategies that allow them to maintain their mental health in the face of such profound solitude. In the end, conquering the final frontier might just as much be about mastering our minds as it is about reaching for the stars.